Hi everyone, this is Blake here in this video and today I will be teaching you on how to download Spotify on your Gear Fit 2 Pro if you're not in the United States. Alright, just so you know, I'm here in KSA and Spotify is currently not available here. So we will be doing something in order for us to work Spotify on this specific device here. You know, this is the Gear Fit 2 Pro in large bands and I bought this from extra stores. Now, why I chose this over the other watch bands is that the price is just um, not too expensive and not too cheap. And all the functionalities that I like when I watch is just right here. And basically I bought this because of the Spotify functionality, but I was quite that not um, impressed when I bought this because it doesn't have the Spotify app in it built in okay so right now I'm scrolling on the apps here and we cannot find the Spotify app now let's get into the steps right here all right so first of all you need your phone we also need the gear fit 2 pro a sim card ejecting tool oops I'm sorry I'm so clumsy all right and this one this will do the magic this is actually a sim card which is from the philippines where i came from and this is from globe telecom um globe actually supports spotify so you will also be needing this you might also be like if you don't have um like a philippine sim card and if you're from other countries but if your country does support spotify you can actually just use that and just so you know, currently I'm using a Saudi Arabia SIM card on my phone here, which is STC. Yeah. Okay, let's get into the process here. But first, let me show you something here. If we try to download an app from the Gear Fit 2 Pro Samsung app here, we go to, let me just lower down the brightness just a little bit so that you can see my screen okay and we go down here samsung galaxy apps okay, still loading and we try to search for spotify i've actually searched for it so i'll go just click that and okay go to apps it says there no search results so basically we cannot download Spotify on an STC SIM card or any SIM card that doesn't support Spotify. Okay. So we have to pop our SIM card out from here. Okay. okay just a moment. My SIM card tray is actually broken. All right. Let's put a SIM card that supports Spotify. In my case, it's Globe Telecom in the Philippines. Alrighty, and our phone will restart to use mobile network. Just wait for it. It will be the same thing if you're using an iPhone. Um, you have to change the SIM card. Still waiting. All right. Now, our watch indicates that it is it has been disconnected to the phone since it has this kind of icon here. This icon means that it has been disconnected to the phone by a Bluetooth. All right, let me just put my code, security passcode, and I think we're gonna be up and running right now. Okay, all right. If your device does not automatically like pair on your phone, you might wanna go to Galaxy Wearable app just a moment here and go to here gear connection okay and turn that on it will search for the watch okay it says that it's connected all right so we're connected right now okay and let's download spotify so from the app, you go to Samsung Galaxy apps. Okay. 
and just a moment here. We go to search. We've actually um, searched for Spotify just a while ago. Let's click on that and go to apps. All right, now it says there Spotify. All right. So we click on that. Okay. It says there accept and download. Click on that. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's currently installing right now. And we'll just wait for the notification that it's installed already. All right. So let's just wait for a few minutes because I think this will download for quite a bit because my internet is not that favorable. All right, it says they're installed. I don't know if you can see that, but it says they're installed. Now, okay, it's actually visible right now in my watch. It says here, Spotify. All right, now, in order for us to like log into Spotify, um, just so you know, you need to have a premium account. In my case, I do have like a 12 month subscription, a premium subscription from Spotify, which I use on my phone here. I do have a Spotify here. And yeah, um, you make sure that you are connected to Wi Fi. So for you to do that, go to settings, connections, Wi Fi is on. Okay. But as long as your device is connected to Wi Fi, that's going to be fine. Okay, let's go back to Spotify. All right, it says here Spotify premium user and free user. Now, in my case, I'm a premium user. I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to be logging in through or with Spotify. Let me just input my details here. Log in. Okay. All right, now you are now streaming on your watch. Now, we cannot play music right from the watch since it's, it doesn't have any speakers. Now, you need like a Bluetooth headset like this one. I have an AirPods here and we need to pair this one to the watch. Okay, go to connections, Bluetooth. Bluetooth headset and my AirPods. Um, I think it's already paired with the watch. And let's try it. Okay. Um, go to Spotify. And let me just try this one. Day stop hits. I do have those playlists on my phone. Okay. I think it's playing right now. Let me just um, put this right into the microphone. Right beside the microphone, I mean, I'm sorry. I hope you can hear that. Alright, I think it's working correctly. So yeah, I think that's about it for um, connecting Spotify or downloading Spotify on your Gear Fit 2 Pro. Now the good thing about this one is that the Gear Fit 2 Pro has like, I think for about four gigabytes of internal storage, but you can only use like two point something gigabytes to download um, local songs here. Now on Spotify, it has this option to download the entire playlist so you can click that if you want to download it and you can just play those songs offline so you don't need to be connected again to the wi-fi network if you are out and about or if you're on a jog or something is to play your music okay just a trick here um you might want to go to settings and there are some information here no device okay now 
If you want to like play songs with ease, you might want to assign double press home key to any of your apps. Okay. So you might want to choose Spotify. Okay. All right. Now, if you're like jogging or running or whatever, if you want to play directly, if you want to um, access Spotify easily, you just want to click this home button right here. This one twice. You know, Spotify will appear directly on the screen. All right, guys, I think that's much about it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope I've helped you in one way or another. And yeah, I hope to see you on the next tutorial. Have a great day.